Hey there everybody, it's Linnea. I'm here with another Friday Frenzy video. So if you're new to this series on the Whimsy Stamps YouTube channel, I like to take products from new releases and older releases and mix them together to show how you can get the most out of your stash. So I am using the bookmark and tag die set as well as the Gnome for the Holiday stamp set. Both of these are new. My older items today are the brushed stripes background stamp and I'm gonna be using the starring hearts papers as well. So I started off with that bookmark and tag die. I cut out the largest die from that die set. I believe that it is meant to be the bookmark die, but I'm gonna use it as a tag, an oversized tag. So I've put that into my stamping platform and I'm using the brushed stripes background stamp now to add a red candy cane background. Now you're gonna see as I stamp this, my background stamp is six by six inches. So it's leaving about, I think a two inch, maybe an inch and a half spot at the bottom of my bookmark tag here. That's not going to be stamped. I'm going to cover that up with the Starring Hearts pattern paper. You could definitely shift your tag or bookmark up or down depending on how you have your stamp positioned and stamp again. But I didn't want to take the chance, since it's a red rubber background stamp, I didn't want to take the chance of misaligning it and then having to start over. So I just thought it would be cute enough to bust out some of my older pattern paper and add that to the bottom. Okay, so now I'm going to be using the Gnome for the Holidays stamp set. This stamp set is super cute. There's three different little gnomes in here. I picked out my favorite. It's this one with a little string of lights, and I'm gonna color him in. Very simple, traditional Christmas colors. So I used R27 and R29. That's my favorite Christmassy red combination. And I am going to be using G14. That's my little marker there that doesn't have the uh, tag on the cap. So G14 and G17 for the green. And then I, for the beard and other white areas, I used C2 and C0 just to give a little bit of shading. Really simple Copic coloring here. And once I'm done, I'll use my scissors and trim that out. I also stamped out some of the sentiments from that gnome for the holiday stamp set. There are a lot of different stamps that are um, like words in here. So there's 11 stamps. They can be built together to form all kinds of different sentiments. Mine is going to be I'll be gnome for Christmas. I just thought that was super cute, but you could be I'll be gnome for the holidays. There's ho 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 in there. So you can be like I'll be ho 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 for the holidays. Really just super cute. I'm going to finish this off with a little bit of twine at the top there. And that is going to complete my gnome for the holidays Christmas tag. Be sure to come back next Friday for another Friday Frenzy video. I'll see you then. Bye. Thank you again very much for watching this video. If you liked this video and you'd like to see more from me, please hit that subscribe button that is on the screen now. And here are a few other videos that I thought you might enjoy.